join Forum IS Academy, trusted by hundreds of toppers, including IS Rank 1 Shruti Sharma. My name is Deepika and I welcome you all to Forum IAS. In this video, we will know about the Association of Southeast Asian Nations, ASEAN. The ASEAN is a regional organization. It brings together disparate neighbors to address economic and security issues. It is an intergovernmental organization of 10 Southeast Asian countries. Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, Singapore and Thailand are its founding members. Brunei, Vietnam, Laos, Myanmar and Cambodia joined later. The free trade partners of ASEAN are Australia, China, India, Japan, New Zealand and Republic of Korea. ASEAN was established in 1967 in Bangkok, Thailand. It is headquartered in Jakarta, Indonesia. The highest policy-making body of ASEAN is the ASEAN Summit. It comprises of the heads of states or governments of the member states. The first ASEAN summit was held in Bali, Indonesia in 1976. The Regional Comprehensive Economic Partnership Agreement RCEP. It is a free trade agreement between the 10 members of ASEAN and its five free trade agreement partners. The five free trade agreement partners are Australia, China, Japan, New Zealand and Republic of Korea. East Asia Summit it is a forum of 18 countries of the Asia-Pacific region. It was established in 2005. Its membership consists of 10 ASEAN member states and Australia, China, India, Japan, New Zealand, Republic of Korea, Russia and USA. It was initially started as ASEAN Plus 3, which included 10 ASEAN member states and China, Japan and Republic of Korea. The areas of cooperation of the East Asia Summit are Environment and Energy, Education, Finance, Global Health Issues and Pandemic Diseases, Natural Disaster Management, ASEAN Connectivity, Economic Cooperation and Trade, Food Security and Maritime. The free trade agreements between India and ASEAN countries are India-ASEAN Comprehensive Economic Cooperation Agreement, which included Trade in Goods and Services and Investment Agreement. India-Singapore Comprehensive Economic Cooperation Agreement India-Malaysia Comprehensive Economic Cooperation Agreement India-Thailand FTA Early Harvest Scheme It was implemented in 2006. This question was asked by UPSC in 2018. Please give your answer in comment section. And also, if you like the video, then please press the like button, share the video and subscribe to Forum IS. Thanks for watching.